Hey guys, it's Martin here, and welcome to a, a little GTA 5 video where I'm uh, basically going to talk about the um, the whole hack that people are doing, uh, where they set a bounty of uh, the most I've ever seen is two billion of in-game online dollars on someone, and if you kill them, you actually get two billion dollars. Now, uh, I wanted to talk about this because uh, I wanted to talk about whether it's good or bad. Now, as you can see, it has happened to me. Uh, I've got the Bugatti, the Z-Type, um, and, uh, and a 9F there. What's supposed to be there is a, a Monroe, but uh, I think it's been impounded because uh, <laughs> I was messing around. So, as you can see, I've got a pre I've got the, the most expensive house in the game. Obviously, I splashed out. Okay, now as you can see there, I've got three, three $3.4 billion. Okay. That's insane. That is honestly insane. Now, I want to talk about whether it's a good thing or a bad thing, and I'm going to jump in my car so I can just drive around and uh, talk about it whilst at the same time, um, yeah, whilst at the same time, um, talking about, like, driving, you know. Um, what the hell is happening on my... Right. Um, I think you can hear the game sound. I don't know, though. On my, if you could hear that through my TV the whole time, then I'm very sorry. But, um, okay, I'm going to drive along, and I want to talk about the good things and the bad things. Now, let's start off with the good things, because everybody loves starting off with the good stuff. Um, the good thing is, you have a lot of money. Okay, you can buy anything and everything. Okay, you can buy the most expensive cars, you can decide. if you Because you're in a limited to 10 cars, you don't care about, um, you know, oh, and if I, if I sell this car, then I won't have enough money to buy it again, because, um, you know, it's... It doesn't really matter because you can just sell it. If you want the car back, you buy it again. Okay, just it doesn't matter. Um, and I moved house. I went from a house that was near the beach, shit view. Uh, so I decided to move uh, to that house that you saw me at, and it was it's the most expensive house in the game. It's four hundred thousand dollars. And again, that hardly even broke my into my um, my bank account. Okay, it is absolutely crazy. Okay, when I first did it, did it, I was um, I was I had a massive grin on my face. I was so happy. I didn't even, I didn't know what to say, okay, and it happened to my mate before as well, and he had had it happen to him for about two days, and uh, he was already getting annoyed, because uh, now this is where I get to the bad things, um, you have no motivation to do jobs, because one of your main motivations to do jobs were to earn money, basically, so you could buy your stuff, um, and at the same time, when you did jobs, you earned, oh crap, you earned RP points, uh, which is basically where, um, that that's how you rank up when you earn, um, I think it's game in-game points or is it influence points? I'm really not sure, but uh, you earn you earn the points to, to rank up, and um, you you can rank up to a high level so you can unlock more stuff. Now having all this money, what it does is it sort of uh, it, it demotivates you. You just you don't want to do it. You've got all this money, you can buy all the cars, and it just doesn't really matter. Like I have this money, I thought, oh yeah, let's get a tank, and you have to be level 71 to get it, and I'm level 49. Now, if I'm level 49 and I have three billion dollars in the bank account, I cannot be asked to go and do jobs for the sake of any money. It just is not right. Okay, I just can't be asked, especially when I just want to mess around with my mates. And you can't get a buzzard, you can't get an attack helicopter. It's it sort of ruins it all completely. It ruins the point of the game. Um, and I, there's this thing that I did the other day, and I uh, why have I got lag on my Xbox? This isn't right. Um, and what I did was uh, I, I killed a guy for 1 billion and I shared it with one of my friends for 500 million and that and I saw him doing import and export vehicles and that is basically him trying to rank up and all that stuff and now because I've done that to him I've given him 500 million which still is a lot of money and he won't go through that definitely um, he will probably um, he will probably never have to do jobs again neither do I so basically guys my advice would be <laughs> if you see someone on a bounty, or in fact, no, don't even claim the bounty. If you're really that desperate for some money, spend your real money, get like 10 million, because that, I think, is enough money. That drift was awesome, by the way. That is enough money to have a bit of fun, and still, you still need to do jobs, because 10 million will go eventually. I mean, especially about how expensive things are in this game. Um, so, that's my advice. If you see someone with a bounty of 2 billion, Try and hold yourself back. I mean, obviously, you will give in because you'll want to have all this fun and you want to buy all the best cars and you want to buy all the all the best houses, well, house. Um, but try and hold back because it is not it's not worth it. If you reach a high enough level that you can get all the stuff that you want, uh, then by all means do it. There's no no reason why you shouldn't. Because uh, I don't think I've not had a message of GTA. I can imagine everyone's account being uh, 
reset or their money being reset, I can see that happening uh, a lot. But basically, guys, that's all I want to say is that um, is this uh, is this hack good or bad? I really don't think so because I think it's ruining people's games. Uh, it's ruining people's motivation to play the game, which means Rockstar are going to have to sort it out very, very soon because less people are going to play it because they're going to have less motivation to play it because they don't need to do any jobs. But uh, that's me. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then leave a thumbs up if you want. And uh, let me know what your opinion is in the comments section. That's all from me, guys. See you later.